So I became interested and familiar with the Pathways to Success document um, through this, my summer writing project this summer um, in July. Um, our, it was a group of teacher librarians that our team's mandate was to create a list of picture books to help teach uh, or to help support the Pathways document um, through the four inquiry questions. And you can find that resource on the teacher librarian website um, under the tab Teach. Uh, September came along and I joined the Pathways Committee and our priority and mandate was to roll out the My Blueprint digital portfolios and, um, and, um, and so when I was exploring the blue, My Blueprint website, when I was exploring my, my, my Blueprint website, um, I noticed that there was an opportunity to upload something. And so there's a chance for you to upload photographs, you can upload um, Word documents, but you can also upload, yeah, that's okay. Yeah, yeah that's fine. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Um, but you can also actually upload a video. And I thought to myself, what a great opportunity this would be to create um, a video, um, a snapshot of, of students in video format reflecting upon the journey to realizing like who they are. Uh, so we piloted this idea with a group of grade 8 students and we gave them the inquiry questions of who am I, what are my opportunities, who do I want to become, and what is my plan for achieving my goals. And this was an exer exercise in self-reflection. So what they were able to do is they, they were able to chat, they were able to... Sorry. <laughs> They were able to chat, they were able to um, jot notes um, to try to answer the four inquiry questions and then they presented them to each other. And what was really great about that was just the dialogue that came out from it. So the students would kind of define or you know, answer the question of who am I? And other kids would listen to that and go, hey, like, you forgot like, encouraging, you're such an encouraging person. Like, you're the class cheerleader, how could you have not included that in your, in your description of yourself? And so the dialogue was a really great piece um, that kind of came out from this, um, the reflect and, and also the reflection on identity. Um, what was not clear, I guess, in the beginning was the kids were working through answering these inquiry questions. And in the beginning, um, they were definitely working through them and talking about them, but at the end, there definitely was some clarity that wasn't there before. And so through this process, um, there was some clarity about that. And um, so I'm just going to show you a really quick uh, student video that, that was created. Um, this is Maya's story. It was created through Adobe Voice, or well, now it's Adobe Spark, but formerly Adobe Voice. And it's an online application that easily pulls together uh, visual media and audio to tell a story. So this is Maya's. What defines me? Who am I? I am Maya, a grade 8 student at St. Julia. I'm an extrovert who loves to converse with new people. I'm not afraid to be who I am and do what I love to do. I see myself as a creative, positive, proud, daring, athletic, bubbly, optimistic, dedicated, hardworking, and courageous individual. But I can also be reckless, oblivious, and insensitive at times. I was born on September 7, 2003 at Credit Valley Hospital. I was sometimes a troublesome baby, but I developed my personality and behavior as I grew up. I love to read, dance, act, create, design, explore, bake, and travel. What are my opportunities? By joining teams and activities, I'm able to be a leader, learn cooperation and teamwork, be in a positive social environment, be myself, and have fun. I am always looking for new creative outlets and opportunities. This encourages me to try new things and exercise the necessary abilities required for me to be the person I am and strive to be. Who do I want to become? For career ideas, some ideas of paths that I might like to take are in business, sports, fashion slash interior design, photography and advertisement, architecture, travel, and doing something I love. There are so many things that I want to become, but as a start, I might like to incorporate some of the things that I love to create a career, like a professional tennis player that designs athletic clothing, an interior designer slash architect that travels the world to design modern homes, or even a creative director or advertising photographer for an advertisement agency. What is my plan for achieving my goals? My plan to achieve my goals is to receive all the necessary education such as high school, post-secondary, and any other education that I may need, courses, classes, etc., leadership groups and self-growth activities, and I also might like to complete community service, volunteer work, and 10,000 hours of effort and practice. After all, I can do anything I set my mind to. This is what defines me and makes me who I am. So that's Maya. <laughs> 
Um, we thought that we would roll this out in grade four to grade eight. Um, we figured that they'd be good year groups to create these video reflections, their milestone years, the beginning of junior, the end of elementary, and also capable of utilizing the technology involved, which is very simple though. Um, this is not an extraneous project, but one that is integrated into curriculum through your religion, you're fully alive, literacy, um, oral communication, and media, and we plan to share this with our, uh, our parent community um, during Catholic Education Week. Thank you.